Hello, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and a visionary of the Valder Beebe Show's That Celebrity Interview. but I know it doesn't feel like that because it's kind of cold today in both places. I had somebody going to warm us up. Anthony, are you still there? I got you. Hey, thank you for joining us today on the Valder BB Show. Oh, my pleasure. Thanks for having me. Well, help us with spring. We've been anticipating spring. You know, we had a rough winter. Boy, we can't wait for some warm weather. Yeah, it'll get here eventually. Uh, we're, we're all hanging on for it, right? Y exactly. What projects can you help us with? Because you're the DIY home guru here. Yeah, yeah. so, you know, I, I finished a project recently for a design client, uh, and I was using, it was a flooring project, and I was using Tarquette's new ProGen line. And I got to tell you, when I was done with it, I am supremely convinced that it is a DIY project. Uh, the only tool you need to install this, this floor is a utility knife. So it could not be more... It could be not, not be more DIY friendly. It's a floating floor system. It's got a click and lock, so you're literally snapping the planks together. Very easy layout. Um, they've got over 20 different styles, so we know that you'll be able to fit your aesthetic. And it is extremely, extremely durable. It's a waterproof flooring, and it's both scratch and indentation uh, resistant. So, you know, it's really checking all the boxes for you. Well, that sounds pretty good, especially with people putting in their own floors. We're watching the DIY channel and think we can rehab a house for under five thousand dollars, and that's not happening. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> you're exactly right. the uh, The costs are not always accurate on those shows, but you know, we the way that we get through them so quickly is by choosing quality products, but stuff that we know we can get installed in a timely manner. So, like I'm saying, the the ProGen line is is certainly one of those. And the other line from Tarquette, if, you, if, you, if you're really a newbie when it comes to DIY, their Transcend uh, Shore Set line, uh, which is right here in front of me, it's actually got a pre-applied adhesive on the back of it. And that adhesive is releasable, meaning if you put it down and you think you made a mistake or you don't like your layout, you can pick that up and put it down up to 10 different times. So for, like I said, for somebody who's new at DIY, this is a great, great starting point. It's got all the same great features as the ProGen line in terms of all the different styles, the durability, the waterproof. Um, so, you know, you've got two really great options here. And you, you know as well as I do, transforming a floor can transform a room in the blink of an eye. That's right. I've never done it. I've supervised. I'm a good supervisor. You're a good supervisor. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> but let me ask you, do you have any environmentally friendly products? Well, these these are uh, certainly are that. Um, they're they're very low cost on the environment. Uh, they're vinyl plank products, um, and you know they they're gonna last a lifetime. So whereas uh, you know hardwoods can buckle, and then you've got to replace stuff. You're throwing more things in dumpsters. These are products that can can withstand the moisture. They have no acclimation time. So when you look at the life cycle of a product, these two things are something that can stay in place for, for the entire life of your home, thereby not adding to the waste that, that, we, that we so often create. Okay, flooring is a, is, is a big thing. Uh, I, I guess that's where uh, companies are making a lot of money from. You know, uh, are there categories of floors? High-end, low-grade, there's different categories we yeah, need there's to know a, about these? There's a ton of uh, different categories. I don't think about them in low-grade, high-grade. I think uh, about them more in aesthetic and what you want to accomplish from a durability standpoint. You know, you have tiles, you have hardwoods, and then, you know, you've got your, uh, your vinyl planking. Um, so it's more about what you're trying to accomplish within your home. And, you know, in talking about DIY, I found both of these products to be super, super friendly in terms of getting them installed. And then on top of that, you add the quality and the durability. And, and listen, there are not many wood look floors that you can say are waterproof. So that in and of itself, if you have pets, if you have kids, you're dealing with spills like we all do in daily life. 
these products are uh, are something that's going to save you a lot of heartache in the long run. Yeah, that sounds good. Anthony <laughs> Carino is the co-host of HGTV's Kitchen Cousins. You've seen him on TV, the good-looking one. That's him. <laughs> Anthony, do you have one more for us, or is it time to tell them where they can get their products? No, we sure do. You know, I mean, listen, when we think about spring, it may be a little chilly, but if you throw a jacket on, you can get out in the yard right now. And when you think about getting out in the yard, you got to think about taking care of your lawn. And, uh, you know, lawn mowing technology has, believe it or not, really come a long way in the last five years. And, um, you know, I'm telling people, whether, whether you're maintaining your old mower or you're in the market for a new one, if you're in the market for a new one, you really want to be looking for mowers that are powered by Briggs and Stratton engines. These guys have put a ton into their R&D in the last five years. A um, couple of quick pieces of technology that they've been working on. And this is my favorite that we're going to start with. It's called the Just Check and Add. You basically get rid of oil changes. So the messiest, most time-consuming part of maintaining your mower now goes out the window. Um, moving on from there, they've got mow and stow technology, which if you're like me and your garage is overflowing, uh, it's a very small footprint for storage. They've also been doing a lot of work on quiet power technology so that you're not bothering your neighbors while you're out there mowing your lawn. And, uh, and last but not least, they've got an instart. Uh, they, they, they've, they've named it instart, and that is basically means that you're never going to be pulling a mower rope ever again. It's battery started. Uh, it's first time every time, and, uh, and it's really, really impressive stuff. So like I said, if you're in the market for a new mower, Powered by Briggs and Stratton is, is definitely something you want to be looking at. Boy, we got a fun summer coming ahead of us. Sure I got a blower for Christmas, so I know how much fun those little tools are. That's right. That's right. Um, you know, and Valder, if, if, if anybody's uh, more curious about this stuff, tipsontv.com is going to have lists and links of everything I, I spoke about here with you today, and, and uh, folks can do a deeper dive on all that stuff. Anthony, I thank you so very much. You've kind of perked up my DIY crew and in the audience. I see them on Facebook. I see you guys. All right. <laughs> we'll, we'll be watching you on TV for more tips. Thanks for being my guest. Thanks so much. Thanks for having me.